Hello guys, welcome to Farida FPV channel again. For this video, if you are new to FPV drone racing hobby, you might be wondering what is the AM board. So this video, we will find out what is it and what does the AM board do to your quadcopter, hexacopter or other aircraft that you are using. Let's see. Well, if you are really new to drone racing hobby, you might not know that you can configure your flight controller via a configurator like butterfly, or beta fly, or flight one, etc. And uh, what you have to do is to plug to connect your quadcopter or the drone into a computer with a USB port, and then uh, click open a configurator and then click connect. So when you are connect. You go to the port. You go to the configuration tabs, and then uh, I'm using the shot secret. So, uh, in order to turn off the air mode, I have to click mode stop when arm, and then uh, you scrolling down. You will see under the other the other features tab. You will see the air mode option here, and the switch is is off uh, in default it is off and if you switch it on it will permanently enable ammo for first example we will, i will uh, turn off the switch first because i you can set it up here and click save or and reboot or the another way to enable ammo is under the mode tab here you see you will have angle mode horizon mode and here Air mode. So uh, you might think that the air mode is a flight mode similar to angle mode or horizon mode, which is uh, will maintain the the wing level uh, parallel to the the skyline all the time, parallel to the earth all the time when you not move your stick. But uh, actually, is not the air mode is not a flight mode. Uh, so here, if you set up an air mode in the most tab. Here you can uh, put it on a switch, which I set it on auxiliary 3 and if I flip my switch here to this range, it will turn on the ammo and I will use this switch to show you uh, what is the ammo and what does it do to your quadcopter so here we click save and if it's disconnect, I will and we will look at the my quadcopter to show you the example of the ammo so here how is how the things work when ammo is off when ammo is off when you arm your quadcopter motor will not spin right and nothing happen but the bat but it will spin when you raise the throttle like that it will spin when you raise the throttle and if you're flying you're flying right and you accidentally or intentionally lower your throttle to the lowest position the motor will stop even in the air the motor will stop spinning even in the air and it will start falling down and it can be uh, the attitude can be changed by external force like wind or the weight balance of the quad itself it may falling down yawing it may fall down banging, it may fall down pitching and you cannot control it because whenever you lower the, the throttle stick to the lowest position any the motors are stopped any command through the stick input will not have a res any response from your drone so you lose the command while you are flying in the contrary, if you turn on the air mode, when you turn on the air mode, whenever you arm the quad, the motor will spin. No matter what the position the throttle is. And the benefit of it is, is when you are flying. Yeah, you're flying, right? And you lower your throttle to the lowest position. The motor is still spinning. And that means you still have control over your quadcopter. 
whenever, no matter what position the throttle is, you can still, when you lower the throttle to the lower position, the lift is near to zero and the quad, the drone will fall out of the sky too. But whenever you roll, you can roll. Whenever you pitch, you can pitch. You can yaw while you are falling. And if you do not uh, command any stick position, the air mode will keep the attitude the same all the way through the fall. Where, for example, for example, you lower the throttle to the lowest position. At this attitude, it will fall down this attitude all the way down to the ground. Well, if you does not recover your quad. That's the benefit of air mode. So another characteristic when uh, when you turn on the air mode is when uh, when you fixing your quad on a table and then you must remove your props because whenever you want to test it and you arm switch the motor will spin. And then another thing is that uh, if you arm the motors and you rest throttle a little bit and you hear the motor sound it will keep spinning faster 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 like that it keeps spinning faster 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 because the flag of the thing that uh, you command higher throttle the quad should have more lift but the prop is not on it so the flag control thing that so oh, this rear there's no lift at all even though the throttle has been rising we should add more lift so it command the motor to spin faster and faster and faster faster because there's still no lift Let's spin faster. Still no lift. Let's spin faster, faster. That's why. And another thing is that when you move your quad, when your arm and move your quad by external force like your hand, this is normal because the same thing happened. The flight controller thing that. There is no command input, no state movement. There's no command input, so the the drone should still stay sit still, should stay sit still. But uh, when you move by external force, you make the quad move, banging, like banging left. The practical thing that well, there's no command. We should still be at this attitude. So if we bang, let increase the left motor to spin higher either to increase the lift and move the drone back to the same attitude because there is no command we should stay at the original attitude that's why so these symptoms are normal okay and that should be all for the air mode if you have any more questions please leave in the comment below and don't forget to like subscribe follow the fpv channel Thank you. See you next time.